What's up YouTube fam? This is Christian the Director. Welcome to 15 Days of Prayer as we prepare for the new year. Today's topic is Unwanted Unloved. This is, I believe, day six. And I thank you guys for tuning in. So basically, I know a lot of us, we felt um, unloved, we felt unwanted, we felt unworthy, felt like, you know, people, people don't want us. Um, sometimes I felt unwanted and unloved and that kind of ties into yesterday's topic with feeling suicidal. Um, you have to really take a step back and just think like, okay, God got me, like God loves me. If nobody in this world loves me, I know for a fact that Jesus loves me. And I know that, I don't wanna say it suck, but it's like, we look to human validation. We look for, we look for, and we look to wanting humans to validate us and love us. So we go buy new clothes and we buy new shoes. I'm not saying this for everybody. I'm just giving examples of what people go through, but we'll buy new shoes because we want that compliment or we will uh, make a, a status on Facebook because, oh, I know this will get a certain amount of likes. So I'm gonna get this attention that I'm seeking for. But when you feel like, when you know that you're getting to a place of wanting to feel like um, you need that attention and you're seeking out for attention really think like oh and say okay I need to really take a step back and go to what the Word of God says and so um, it's gonna really redirect your mind It's gonna redirect um, your emotions towards um, good morning towards feeling um, God's love God in, in the word it said God loves cover a multitudes of sin. God's love sustains us. God and we and we know these things, but like I said, because of so much sin and so much our flesh gets caught up. Um, our flesh gets caught up in the day-to-day -day, um, motions of life. And so we, like I said, we, we go on to other people. We go on to social media for validation and we forget that God really covers us. God, God sustains us. God keeps us. And so that is what today's prayer is about. All right, God, in this time of feeling unwanted, in this time of feeling unloved, your word clearly says in Romans, we shall, we, who shall separate us from the love of Christ, not trouble, not hardship, <clears throat> not persecution, not danger. So please open our minds, open our hearts to continue to be reminded by your word that the enemy, nor the issues of life, nor our emotions will separate us from your love. You said your love, you said you have loved us with everlasting love and a love that will never fail unlike us humans, unlike us with flesh. We know your love will never leave us. We know, your, we know your love will never forsake us. We know your love will never run out. Your word says that your love has been poured into our hearts by the way of the Holy Spirit, by the way of the Holy Presence, oh God. You said we should come to you when we are heavy. You said we should come to you when we feel weary, when the burdens are unbearable. You said that you will give us rest. We may, we may walk through the darkest valleys, God. We may take the wrong paths in life. We may feel out of place. You say not to fear because you are with us. You are comforting us. God, thank you for your presence. Thank you for always being present in our lives, oh God. Uh, when we feel like no one is with us, when we feel like no one loves us, and we feel like no one is there, we know that you are there, God. Thank you for reminding us of that, oh God. We love you because you first loved us, God. God, I declare right now that your love you have for me will never be we, that I'll be able to love myself the same way God help me to love myself the way you love me God help me to see myself the way you see me God and I will no longer look to the things of this world I won't I, I won't look to people of this world to show me love I will no longer look for validation in the year 2023 but I will set the tone and I will create the pattern to love me God I'm denouncing the spirit of feeling unloved I'm denouncing the spirit of feeling unwanted it can no longer attach itself to me it can no longer attach itself to my mind. It can no longer attach itself to my family. It can no longer attach itself to my friends in the name of Jesus. All because I know in my heart that Jesus loves me. Your love endures forever. The word says there is no greater love than to lay down one's life for friends. This is a constant reminder how we cannot compare God's love to a human. 
when we feel rejected by someone we feel ignored don't we help us to not take offense to it because in your word it says humans love and God's love does not compare so Jesus we thank you for your love and we continue to rebuke it or uh, rebuke uh, the spirit of that we reject it and we denounce the feelings that of feeling unloved and unwanted in the name of Jesus and we declare these things to be so thank you my YouTube fam oh yeah give yourself some affirmation say say I am love I am wanted I bind it in the name of Jesus Satan you can't take my mind today I come again against it I come against every person that, that tries to make me feel in love and tries to make me feel low I come against it over your lives as well in the name of Jesus and that is it for today you guys be blessed right now but he gonna be there yeah he gonna be there I ain't stepping foot in your church unless you really keep him first yeah. world getting a little crazy I ain't even trying to